He was always such a nice kid. How do I leave all of my land to him if he's behaving this way? How do I know if it will be safe? All of your land? What about me? But you're a woman. And so? It doesn't count? Of course you count. But why would you need land? Dad, why are you dismissing me just because I'm a woman? I'm also your child. But you're a girl. Yeah. If it wasn't for this girl, you wouldn't have had any land to come back to after so many years in prison. Red, it's tradition. Land is for boys, you know that. Besides, you'll have lots of land of your own as Pippi's wife. I want my own land from you. Every girl has a right to inherit land just like any boy. My daughter, who has been filling your head with such a crazy ideas. You're married now. And when Pippi inherits his land from his father, he will take care of you, just as Toby will take care of his wife one day with the land I leave to him in my will. Please, Red. Try to understand. Understand what? That you'd rather leave your land to your adopted son than me, your own flesh and blood. I think I may have to go to work after all. That way, you know, I'll save up some money and buy myself a piece of land. Welcome home, Dad. Red. Red. Hey. Thank you. Dad. I thought I would come and see where my little girl works. Of course, you're welcome. Red, I'm impressed. You've made a real success of your life. It's amazing what girls are allowed to do these days. Red, don't you see? This isn't about you. Isn't it? No. This is just the way things have always been done. It's not that I don't trust you, and it doesn't mean that I love you any less than Toby, but it's just that this land is precious because it tells the story of how our ancestors made it to this point. If I gave it over to you, then it would no longer be Mulani land, it would be Baraka land. And then all the suffering, all the hardship, the pride that got our family to this very moment would be lost in a second. Dad, we are more than just the name. Just because I'm Red Baraka right now doesn't mean that I'm no longer your child. No, it doesn't. But it does mean that you are now also part of Pippi's family. And his family has no right to the Mulani estate. But Pippi would never assume that. He would respect the fact that you left the land to me and it belongs to me and me alone. But whether Pippi laid claim to it or not, if you both had children, then there would be barakas and your land would belong to them. Dad, I already told you, Pippi and I are not planning to have any children. And even if we did, they would be your grandchildren. Honestly, would you begrudge them their inheritance? But don't you see? Their surname would be Baraka, and it wouldn't be their inheritance without it also belonging to the Baraka family too. But they are also your family. And in generations to come, our story, the Mulani legacy would be lost forever. All anybody would be knowing about would be the Barakas. I'm sorry, Red. My mind is made up. Then you'll have to excuse me, Dad. I have work to do. <laughs> 